Kathleen Leach's son was named Curtis Walker. He was 13 years old and he was one of 29 victims murdered in Atlanta from 1979 to 1981. Most of them African American children. She never got any answers. None of the parents did. The Atlanta child murders case was never solved. After 11 Lives, Naima Abdullah, he spoke to her about her wish to build a memorial for her son and all the other victims. There is now real progress starting now. It is day one of police reevaluating the evidence. Mayor Keisha Lance Bottoms reopened the case yesterday. It is a piece of our city's history that 40 years later, it's really hard to believe. To know that the family still don't have peace. We are where Atlanta speaks and people online are so relieved that these families could finally be getting some answers. Sandy says this brings back so many emotions. She was 11 when it happened and the first child who went missing was the brother of a classmate. She says she cried as if it was her own little brother and Sue's grateful that after all this reporting, the city is reopening this case. She says hopefully with the advancements we've made in DNA, we might find something new. We want to hear your stories about how you felt if you lived in Atlanta during this painful time or what you're learning about these cases now. We're always open. You can comment on our stories on our 11 Live Facebook page or tweet us. All right, here's three stories you need to know right now. Teachers in Indiana.